everyone, for this magic minute, I'm gonna show you how to launch your very own student room. So the first thing you're gonna to do to launch a room is you're gonna to go to the purple button that says launch to students. So here you'll see a bunch of saved rooms that I have already opened, but for today, I'm gonna to show you how to open a new room. So I'm gonna go up to launch new room in the corner. From here, you can name the room, something specific, whatever you'd like, change the grade level. I'm gonna change it to fifth grade, and then you can choose the maximum number of students that can enter this room. Hit next. Now you're gonna see a large list of tools that students could potentially have access to. But what's nice about these student rooms is you as the teacher get to choose which tools the students use and when to use it. I'm gonna give students access to the research assistant and I'm also gonna give them access to the debate partner. Now you can see up here at the top, I've got tools that are going to be launched to the students. Now I'm gonna go ahead and click next. I can actually customize these tools before they go out to students. So I'm gonna do that with the debate partner. I can change the name if I'd like to, but I'm gonna leave it for now. I can give a description. I'm gonna choose the topic that I want them to debate. So there's the topic that they will have. Then I can even choose which position the students have to take in a debate. I'm gonna leave that blank for now. This is actually an example of what the students will see when they open the room and they click on this tool. So right now they can see the prompts themselves. But if I want to hide those prompts, I can click this little blue eyeball and you'll see that one of those prompts disappears. So I'm going to click next. From here, I can actually test this out as if I was a student. I can click generate and now you can see that it's going to start this debate. I'm happy with this. I'm going to click done. So now I'm ready to launch to my students. I'm going to go up to the right corner and I'm going to click launch room. And then here you can see there are three different ways that I can have students join this room. Anyways, I hope you found this video helpful. If you have any questions about how to set up student rooms or what you can do with them, let me know in the comments below.